Is your job safe? Let's talk. Hey guys, it's your girl Emma here and welcome back to my channel, Recipe for Success. Today, I'm gonna be talking about whether or not project management is recession proof. If you guys enjoy this kind of content, please give this video a big thumbs up. And as always, thank you to my channel members. You guys rock. I really appreciate your continued support. If you're interested in supporting the channel in that way, there's a link down below in the description. Let's get right into this video, guys. First, you might wonder, why do we need to talk about whether or not project management is recession proof? I want to take you guys back to the last great recession that happened, not 2020, but before that, 2008. This was at a time for me personally when I was not working, I was too young, but it did have a really fundamental impact on me as an adolescent in the fact that I was old enough to understand what was going on, but obviously didn't have any control over what was happening. Possibly a lot of people felt this way. If you weren't aware, the unemployment rate in 2008-2009 peaked at roughly around 8.5% in the United States. That's almost one in every 10 adult losing a job or being unemployed. This included, in fact, the adults in my household. I remember that that really did have a large impact. It was scary to live through, and it was one of those things where you just didn't know. And when when adults in the house are scared or concerned about what their path is and whether or not they can maintain a job, you can see that impact throughout the entire family. I think that's one of the reasons why I wanted to make this video, to talk about what does the research show, what information is out there around how well project management holds up during an economic downturn. Now, obviously, I don't know what's gonna happen with the economy. I can't predict that. I'm in no way saying that there is going to be a recession, but if you're like me and you're reading the financial news or you're listening to any podcasts, there has been a lot of speculation about whether or not we're heading into a recession. From a statistical standpoint, today's unemployment rate is roughly 3.6%. Now that's a really good unemployment rate. Obviously not great for those who are unemployed, but it is a good indicator that lots of people are employed actively. And that's come down significantly from the peak 10% in 2020. So where are all the rumors of the recession coming from? Well, I don't think it's any surprise to anyone that things are kind of tough in the current economy. We have some inflation going on. We have interest rates that are rising and housing prices, at least where I'm at, continue to increase and climb up. So there are other things that are concerning with the economy, which again is why we're gonna talk about whether or not project managers are recession proof. So one thing that I thought was really interesting is I went back to PMI and tried to search for this topic. Is project management recession proof? And I found this article published in 2008 in the middle of the Great Recession where they're talking about project management as a recession proof job. Now I think this is really optimistic in terms of thinking about project management as recession proof. In the article, the author talks about the fact that while there are sectors of the economy that are that are being directly impacted by the recession, he calls out the fact that a lot of those jobs that are being eliminated are industry specific. Thinking about things like construction, mortgage banking, and he then calls out industries that are at this time at least not impacted. So sales and marketing, IT, healthcare. And then he talks a lot about how there are actively employers who are desperate for project management workers, especially in IT and healthcare and they can't find enough resources to fill all these roles. I think from my perspective, what I take away from this is that project managers will always have a job and there will always be some element of opportunity for people with project management skills. The key here, which this guy also calls that in this article, is about being versatile, as versatile as possible, having some business know-how and transferable skills. I actually recently made this video around transferable skills as a project manager. I talked about transferable skills that I use in my personal life, but I think the idea is the same, that you want to really focus as a project manager on creating as many transferable skills and being versatile. It's the same advice that I would give to anyone who's brand new and looking for a job, which is you're gonna have to be flexible flexible with that first opportunity. And then as you get further in your career, you can be pickier and pickier. In the event of an economic downturn, I think project managers will still have an important role to play and there will still be industries hopefully unimpacted that are looking for project managers. And so at that point, it's a question of, are you willing to pivot? Are you flexible enough to go out and find a role, even if it's not the perfect role, to have employment? So what I mean by that specifically is, if you're a construction project manager and your construction job gets impacted 
and you get laid off, can you take those skills that you used as a construction project manager and move that over into something like IT architecture project management? The other article that I found that I talked about this question of project management as recession proof was really interesting. It was from a guy who owned his own company and they did project management consulting. And he talked a lot about this circle of recessions where essentially the economy is in a period of growth, then it's a period of leading into a recession, then it's in a recession, then it's a period of leading into growth and then back to growth. And he talks through the fact that in all four of those periods, while some periods were better than others, growth leading into growth, he didn't talk about the fact that there is still work for project managers when they're in a recession or leading into a recession. And I thought this was really interesting. He talked about the fact that businesses want to continuously improve their business. They'll always have some strategic operations and they'll call on him in these downtimes to do things like make their processes more efficient. And that kind of strategic work requires project managers to come in and help manage and execute these projects. So that to me was also really positive and optimistic in terms of outlook on project management jobs during a recession. To sum it all up, I think the moral of the story is that we obviously can't predict recessions and we can't predict what industries are gonna be impacted during a recession. But what we can say is that there are ways that you as a project manager can strive to reduce the impact and risk to yourself during a recession. So again, thinking about things like being as versatile as possible, focusing on those transferable skills and general business know-how. Let me know below what thoughts you guys have. Do you believe that project managers are a recession-proof job and career? Do you feel like the potential next recession that everyone's talking about is going to hit some industries like IT harder than others? Let me know. And let me know down below in the comments if you guys like this type of content, this type of video, compared to my other videos, which are more how-to videos of project management. We'll talk to you guys next time. Thanks, bye.